All right, guys. So this is probably going to be a really, a really bad idea. If you guys have been around the channel for some time, you're probably familiar with the Outlast one full walkthrough that we did here a few months ago. We also did the Whistleblower DLC. And ever since we finished that walkthrough, I've had numerous, and I mean a lot of comments, a lot of suggestions from a lot of you guys for us to do Outlast 2. Now, about four years ago or so when this game came out, I did play the game, but a lot of it was streaming and I wasn't really particularly a full Let's Play walkthrough channel. And I feel like those videos were just kind of like all over the place and they weren't chronologically ordered, if you will. This time, I feel like it's gonna be different because I have the story of Outlast fresh in my mind and when i played this game not only was the live stream then kind of rushed but i never finished outlast so i was kind of a little bit in the lost and now i have the full story of outlast one which was fantastic fresh in my mind also we're going to be playing out on pc and also it's been four years so i kind of wanted to revisit this video game and kind of see what it has in stores and kind of see what it does for me as as an experience perspective if you will and we'll see how the video does i'm not saying it's going to be a full series i'm just saying i wanted to revisit this game a couple of days ago we played a horror game and that's the thing about me that when i play a horror game i kind of get in the groove and then i get too freaked out over too many games and i kind of take a break and then i'll come back and you know the cycle continues so right now we are in the horror game phase so i want to kind of you know take advantage of that come back here play outlast 2 revisit the game the experience and see how it does see how you guys react to it and uh we'll take it from there again this is probably a really bad idea but it's an idea that i want to i want to take head on full force ahead balls to the wall and um i really hate this game just i just thought i'd let you know anyways as always my name is hollow and welcome Lynn Langerman is an investigative journalist seeking the answers behind a pregnant woman murdered under impossible circumstances in rural Arizona. You are Blake Langerman, her husband, assistant, and cameraman. Record everything. Neither of you are fighters. To navigate the horrors waiting in the desert, your only choice is to run, hide, or die. Please, Blake. Where are you? <sighs> This was a mistake. I'm this is a big mistake. He's coming. Ah! He's here! Ah! Get away! Ah! Jesus, Blake, are you really sleeping? I'm awake. You should have slept last night. Well, I had to get that hospital footage organized. You were calling out some other woman's name. What? In your sleep. Jessica, I think. You know a Jessica? Oh, uh, no, no. I mean, I was dreaming about Jessica Gray from when we were kids. Oh, yeah. I, I haven't thought about her in ages. Hey, we're crossing into reservation land now. You said I'm looking for some sort of factory? Yeah. We can look, but there's nothing out here. It does look pretty empty. All the mercury in that woman's blood, she had to have spent at least a decade downstream from some pretty heavy industry. If you say so, man, you bought the time. It looks so good. While we're up here. Production value? Sure. Coming from Outlast you know, one. My diaphragm with this thing on. Dude, this is crazy. Oh, what a big difference. We'll have to Whoa. Oh, shit. What the fuck? fuck. Alright, let's calm down Sorry here. The panel's a little soft, but uh well, we're good. Oh, that was exciting. Get as much of the landscape behind me as you can. You got me? Yeah, we're good. Um, hum, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. Have a soup pie. Have a soup pie. Okay. I'm Lynn Langerman, here for Newstomorrow.net. We're flying past the Have a Soup Pie Indian Reservation in Central Arizona, in search of the origins of murder victims. Hey, Lynn. Um, I don't think you should say murdered. We don't know that. Oh, I'll say she strangled herself to death. That's what the police report says. We may play this before the doctor interviews. If this falls on the first 30, we need to get the word murder in there. We should probably mention the fetus, too. I mean, how it just... Here, let me try a version that can serve as an intro for the whole piece. Tell me when we're good. Okay. We're good. To 
weeks ago, a young woman was found wandering, barefoot, pregnant, and alone on a barren stretch of highway a hundred miles from the nearest town. Oh. oh, God. Oh. oh, so it begins. Oh, fuck. Oh. By the way, Outlast Trials or whatever, the third one is going to be coming out eventually. And supposedly it's before the first and the second one. And I kind of remember the scene of the helicopter. And this is why sometimes I enjoy coming back to certain games. But it's the little details that you don't really remember. Okay, it's the little details. And now we are in some sort of school or church. I'm sorry, I just have to, uh, I don't like playing this game. I mean, our last one was disgustingly scary. Oh, fuck. Okay. Why does this game look so real? I'm playing it on the computer. I never have before, but God, it looks so real. Okay, this is probably a memory. The memory we were talking about right when we were kids. First place to Jessica. There we go. Excellent. It's me, Jessica. If you guys have ever seen the hot chick, you probably remember that iconic moment in uh, film history. Yes. Dear Jesus Christ. I love how every single horror game puts Jesus. Like if he's supposed to save me or something. I think I remember that creepy bastard. Okay, how do we run again? We can't run here. Dude, this game looks so darn good. I mean, again, our last one looked good, but this this is a step above and beyond. This is like Ultra Instinct versus Super Saiyan 3. You know, it it looks really good. And again, due to high demand of uh, emotions, I will be speaking a lot throughout this video. Oh, fuck. Totally okay. Ah, fuck. We're not alone here. I have people in my house. They're going to think I'm crazy. You know what? Welcome to welcome to the Hollow Residence, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome. Okay, so now we're back. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, perfect. We got it. Come on, giddy up. Let's do this. Oh my God, this looks so real. I love the graphics, dude. I mean, I love horror games, and it doesn't matter if it looks crappy or not. A horror game is a horror game, and, and, and you will jump no matter what. It's a horror game, but man, when you have shit like this, looking this good, I'm... I'm Lynn. Lynn. Press back to view your objective. Find Lynn. Nothing matters but Lynn. Okay, view your objective. Uh, hold on. This is my objectives. Come on, come on. So Lynn is my wife. Review footage. Okay, this is uh, the Jane Doe story part one, part two. Display chrono chronologically. Excellent. Videos. Make sure there's nothing extra in here. Ten pages. Let me just make sure there's no... All right. Good. Bro, look at the hands on this guy. Look at his fingers. I don't remember this game looking this good. Okay, hold on. So we, where, where am I supposed to go? Oh God, I feel so dumb. Am I, oh, is it down here? Yes. You see, this is what I'm saying. Like there's little details that you never remember. And that is what matters. Those are the little details that count. So jump over. Okay, excellent. To get on the ledge, just move. To move on ledges, strafe left or right. I cannot wait for the next Outlast game. This is going to be phenomenal. Oh, I'm going to be in there like swimwear, baby. Let's go. Important events should be captured on video. Press RB to raise your camera. Recording will automatically start. Indicate by a blinking red light. 
When the recording sign blinks, it means you are aiming correctly at the recording event. Aim at the event onto the red circle as full to successfully capture that moment. Excellent. Oh shit. Video recorded. Review Jesus. recorded videos to learn about the events. No, there's no bodies. She's not in here. Lynn! Lynn! Okay, so let's go to the camera. Okay, so they took her. That's right. <gasps> okay, hold on, hold on. The wreckage. We can play. She wasn't there. Lynn's body wasn't in the wreckage. She could still be alive. Excellent. Okay, so now this. Oh, God. She looks possessed. Okay. We're good. Two weeks ago, a young woman was found wandering, barefoot, pregnant, and alone on a barren stretch of highway 100 miles from the... All right, so I think we're good. I'm just going to replay this one just so it's not like... I still have an exclamation mark on this. Is it just because we still have an objective? Okay, that's that's fine. So they took the body. Obviously, these guys took my wife. It's kind of fucked up. The crazies will be crazies. All right, what do we have here? Pick up a bandage. See how many bandages you have pressed back. I've got, look at the right, oh, dude. <laughs> what, are you kidding me? You cannot, uh, you don't need to use a bandage right now. I forget about that. You can actually look at your pocket to see the bandages. That's insane. Is there anything else in here? Okay, use night vision to see in the dark. Raise your camera and press the right stick. Oh, God. See, this is a very classic, iconic, outlast type of, uh, camera view <gasps> ah, fuck oh, oh fuck me fuck 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 that did not happen in the crash fuck this Lynn. that is just fabulous and it couldn't even be any darker right now this game could not be any darker I don't even remember his name. That's the pilot. What the fuck kind of people would skin somebody alive? Oh, Jesus Christ, Lynn. Uh, I can honestly say if, if you ever wanted to be a news reporter, this would probably, um, <laughs> this was pro this, this would definitely not be the game you'd want to be playing right now. I, I don't think this would encourage you very much. So you can look. Back. Oh, oh, I gotta hate that. Unfortunately, I gotta look forward and I gotta use my damn camera. Okay, we've got another set of batteries, so we're good. Oh. The town. Oh, thank God. I thought we were miles from anything. <laughs> oh, God, I love it. Hold on. Let's check this out. There's not supposed to be anything for miles. But I wasn't alone out here. Fuck, I wasn't alone out here. God. Jesus Christ. Alright, so we dude, I I honestly like I honestly forgot how beautiful this game really does look. It really is something special. I don't Hello? know. Somebody open up! I'm lost. FBI, open it up! Hurt. Imagine landing on a town, right? Where all of a sudden you see your wife missing and a pilot skinned alive and you're knocking on doors. Like, are you crazy, stupid, or dumb? Listen here. I am well trained in the arts of martial arts. And I'm not scared to use my knowledge. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, 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 no. This was a bad idea. Oh, this was. Ah! There. Please. Oh, 
god. Okay. Pick up the battery. Hey. Hey, man. Uh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. You're... This just happened. Oh, god. I'm... Okay, so I'm just going to say right now, this is only going to be a one episode type of thing. There's no way I play this again. Photo take and press to view it. Okay, so we could just read this from here, right? The clean text. Ah, oh, my dear sweet Ellie. I can't bear what we did, what we done. Nor being apart from our little ones. So I'm going to go over and hoping you forgive me for leaving you behind. And God forgive us. Oh, and God forgives me this last trespass. Uh, I know that uh, they had to be offered up. But I'm all tore up inside and can't live no more. Hopefully the end will come soon and we can be together again unless God burns me forever for this sin. Until then, I hope you find what you, uh, what woman's comfort you need in the arms of Papa Noth. Yours forever, Tom. So this guy made some sort of sacrifice, killed himself due to the sacrifices, hoping for forgiveness, and then tells his wife, hopes to see her soon in heaven, but maybe he won't get to heaven. But hope, but also hopes that he finds or, or that she finds comfort in another man's arms. Sounds like a great relationship you got there, Paco. Deserve, you deserve that death. Okay. Open up. Oh, fuck. This is so bad. This is so terrible. Okay, so... Oh, hi! Who's... Okay. Oh, God. Okay, so... Hold on. There's a door. Oh. There's a door right here. Can I open up this door? No. There's a little tricycle. Okay, so I, I I remember this part somewhat. Like not this part, but like when. Fuck. Okay, wait. Hold on. Yeah, that that's a cow. That's a dead dead cow right there. I do remember the witch part. I think it was around this area. That is one thing that traumatized me for the rest of my life. And I know for a fact. Let me just make sure there's no like batteries. We can hide here. Now you know the game is fucked when you can hide. Oh god. Just making sure there's no batteries or anything that I haven't seen that I can pick up. Alright, here we go. Oh! Flippity fuck! Where do I crouch? There we go. Alright, I'm pulling out the camera, dude. Fuck this. Yo, open up. Let's go, player. Okay, there was somebody here. I'm, I'm pretty sure of it. I'm gonna close that door. Just in case. Oh, God. Okay, hold on. We've got a bandage. So, this is how we look at the bandages. Find we got Lynn. Nothing matters but Lynn. Put that camera away, sir. We're gonna need those batteries. You can hide in there. You can hide by crawling under beds. Excellent. I'm not gonna use that right now. Thanks for the uh, <laughs> FYI. All right, let's read this up. So, dear father, our loving God continues to bless me with the visions, and I know more certain than ever that the enemy is nearer with every day. I was scrubbing the stains from the floor of Daniel's room when the blessed music rose inside, uh, inside me and sank me into true sights where I saw a creature like the burning sun, but with inward rings of teeth upon teeth and dangling beneath limbs that I took to be arms 
but were cocks that rose in childing purpose. And as this monstrous sun descended, it fucked the earth and birthed some great and slouching horror from the fire. All right. I was filled with the same fear, so great that I could not breathe nor move and saw myself all of those, all of those years back blinding. Daniel with the lie and tried to weep but could not. And when I woke up, I found myself wet with lusting, painfully des des desirous uh, to feel a man inside me. And the feeling was not so different from the fear. I tried to comfort myself with your teachings. Terror is a joy in the movement of God. But I would not take greater comfort in your manhood inside me and a firm prayer that the an an Antichrist be strangled in my womb. The most faithful of your flock in holy longing. What in the fuck did I just read? Okay. Okay. All right, in we go. In we go. We're going to get this battery. There it is. Nobody's in here. Is there anybody in there? I don't think so. I think we're A-OK -okay so far. To open windows, press X. All right, so we can go in. <laughs> This is some bullshit. Oh god, this game is way too dark. I I feel like I'm Okay. What is this? That's locked. Just making sure. Yeah, I'm probably just, just, oh man. Here we go. All right, excellent. A lot of letters there. I probably just missed those letters. Oh. I'm not going to reload just yet. Oh God. Oh God. Oh my goodness. This reminds me of Resident Evil Village, bro. This is terrifying. This is essentially a village. Satanas is Satan. Satanás. Away, demon. Oh, God. Well, this is just fabulous. That's got to be something important, right? That, that's, 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 isn't that the sacrifice? So pick this up. And it says the following. So, midwife's laments. The babe is coming. Ready the knife. The babe is coming. Knight's midwife. Whether to the enemy stained within, God's creation saved with sin. The chorus. Hallelujah. Stay the storm. No longer must we wait. Uh, for come to the dawn of the uh, the enemy born. To die in the temple gate. The temple gate, I'm sorry. The babe is growing. The, her belly swells. The babe is growing. Sent from hell. Ezekiel awaits a sharpening his blade. Gather at the gate, we kneel and pray. The chorus, hallelujah, blah, blah, blah. Fucking sickos. And there's maggots there too, huh? No, those are flies. I don't know what that is. Let me just make sure there's nothing here that I can record. That's like a chicken with a, with some sort of mask. All right, nothing here should be recorded. Can I, can you guys at least leave me a battery here, man? Like, come on. Oh, 
Oh, hi. What in? I swear to God. God. That's a cross, right? Yeah, that is a cross. Yeah, there it is. Record all of it. All of it. That's right. Everything is being recorded right now. Yes. It was a familiar smell, almost sweet. They, they killed their children. Wait, but those are not kids. Those are just dolls, right? Wait, those are actually, oh no, those are kids? Nah, those are not kids. Nah, those are not, those are not real kids, right? Those are dolls. Are those real kids? I always thought those things were dolls. I always thought those things were dolls, bro. I swear. Okay, we're here. There we go. I'm gonna crawl up under. It's okay. We got this. We've played plenty of horror games in our lifetime here on this channel. This shouldn't be anything new. Okay, none of this should be new to us. This should all be very familiar. The feelings, the vibes. It's all scary, but fuck it. It doesn't. Who the fuck is that? Oh, this is the part with the witch, right? All right. Okay, I'm already expecting it. Hello? Hi, ah, fuck! Uh, uh, what the fuck? Oh, God! She's coming, she's coming, she's coming, she's coming, she's coming. Hello? I want to go inside that house. Open up, open up, open up! <gasps> Close that shit. Okay, what is this? Can't carry any more bandages. How do I heal up? Lynn. Nothing matters but Lynn. Okay, fine, Lynn. We got it, bro. We got this. All right. Another battery. That's always a plus. That is always a plus. Excellent choice. This is locked. That is just fabulous. I mean, why wouldn't it be locked? Go down here. What? 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 You can move objects by holding square. I mean, uh, uh, X. Okay. Wait, we can jump up here. Bro, is that the witch again? Oh, hold on. We've got something here. It's crazy how all of this feels so new to me. I mean, it's been four, maybe almost five years, so I get it, but. All right, boys. All right, so this is not over yet, guys, okay? We're going to keep crawling here. Everything is totally fine. This is just a regular village. Oh, fucking shit! Oh, we're screwed. 
Oh, and we wear glasses. That is just. Oh, Jesus! Who? Then you'll have. God wants to be dead. Okay. Oh, that was the witch, huh? Oh God. That to me is the creepiest um, enemy Outlast has ever done. That one and the one from the whistleblower. That guy, uh, the one that wanted to like, you know, tickle your behind. That guy was creepy as fuck too. But she's just scary, dude. All right, so I'm just gonna make sure there's nothing here. No, no, no need to hide. That's okay. Exit. I love the attention to detail on the character's arms and I don't know. It's just really good. Really well done. Press B to hide in the waist high plants. All right, so we got to hide here or what the fuck's going on? I'm trying my best not to use uh, the camera when I don't need to. You can hear through walls and track sounds with your camera's microphone. Press RB to raise your camera. So there's somebody there. All right, let's let's go ahead, make sure that we cannot gather anything here, and then we're gonna leave. We're gonna open up that window, and we're probably gonna leave through here. Open up the window. Okay, there they go. That's them right there. Perfect. Excellent. This is probably good to use so we kind of know where to go in a way. There's got to be something in this house. Yep. Lock that fucking... <laughs> Lock that door. Yes, sir. Okay, I'm going to put away the camera. We've got this. Forsaken. Everything is totally fine. We're now in an open field with these lunatics. Oh shit. Stop! Bro, it's so fucking dark in this game, dude. I can't see anything. Okay, so I'm gonna wait for this guy. And we shall be turned. Because the mountain of Zion was desolate. Foxes walk upon it. He's right there. Okay, there he goes. I'm sure he's the only one there. Perfect. He saw me. Ah, what the fuck? Oh, 
fuck daddy, was that? Help. Fire. What are we gonna have? To live still, Daddy. Please. Put him down. Daddy, oh God. No, I don't want to. Oh God. Okay, hold him down. Give me the oh knife. Oh shit. They can't even see me. Like they're. It's like they're hypnotized. Why was this All right, hold on. What does it say? Do you hate this <sighs> God, I fucking hate this game. My love, please try to be strong as you can. Papa tells us that ever uh, tells us that ever service that God remembers. Hold on, dude. I can't even read right now. My love, please try to be as strong as you can. Papa tells us at ever service that God remembers us, remembers us, our sins and our dreams. And we gotta face our sins if we want to get right with God. If the visions are gr getting worse, and the dreams are in our waking eyes, it is just means that uh, the, uh, the tribulations are coming closer. And that'll be hard. And that'll be hard, but there is paradise on the other side. God loves us. And don't never give up on us more than... Uh, and doesn't ever give us more than we can handle. Yours always fill up. Bro, I can't read right now, dude. I, I can barely read normally. Right now, it's even worse, okay? I'm just saying. Okay. Oh, that's our wife, Lynn. Is it here? Oh, fuck. I lay these hands on this assembly center and ask that you reveal the truth. Pray with me, children. God, 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 God. Bro, what the fuck? Okay, hold on. What do we have here? Hold on. I'll get back to that. Give me a sec. Hold on. Is there anything down here? Hello? Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Oh, this is terrifying. All right, listen here, fellas. I know. You're, oh. Give me everything you want. Give me your lives. Give me your children. Give me their lives. I'll show you. I'm ready for the hoax. Break me down. Give me a sweet temptation. I'm quite really sorry. I offended the prophet. Dude, what the fuck? I remember this game being nuts, bro, but <laughs> this is just crazy. Let me go down here. There's a letter down here. Paul. As you got Papa Noth's ear, I'm asking that you tell him a worrisome story that I hope is only my fears and nothing factual. The chief among his deacons, Val. Came to me before sunrise this morning with an offer that was not fully described. Val acted like somebody offering something secret and sexual in nature. But by my knowledge of Val and his character, it frightened me terribly, and I would not accept any such invitation. Val would rather uh, would not further explain and and uh, and told me that there are places in our hearts Papa Noth cannot reach. Though truth be told, Val seemed more interested in those other areas of my body. I asked Val to return this evening once I had a chance to think it over. But it is only so that Noth may send some men of firm character to secretly witness what I suspect is blasphemy and betrayal and cut it off before any harm is done. I hope Papa can help as I am dreadful scared. Ruth. Bro, they're like super blind to this Papa Noth guy. Oh, we can peek over as well. Shit, nice. Oh, 
We got some keys right here. I like that objects are visible by pressing. Find Lin. Nothing matters. But I like how everything is like in his hands or his pockets. That's so freaking cool. Oh my god, man, my fucking neck hurts. Okay, let's go up here. Should I go upstairs? Hello, Papa Noth? Are you in here? <laughs> Maybe. You son of a bitch. What do we have here? Another chapter. Chapter 11 through 7. I don't know if I want to read all these chapters, though. I normally read everything in these horror games. Like, I love reading stuff, but those chapters... I'm probably gonna give a hard skip on those for, for, for this. Everything else I'll read. Oh, hold on, hold on. Okay, that's locked. I just had to make sure that I wasn't able to go up there. That's locked. Of course it's locked. Well, that's my fucking wife right there, bro. What are they doing to her? I think they kill her, right? Lynn. <gasps> ah. Oh! Oh God, Blake. Are you okay? No. What the fuck? I don't know. Oh shit. Hey. We have to run. Hey. Okay, let's go. 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 Lynn, where are we going? Away from here. Anywhere but here. This is just like a uh, Resident Evil 7 and a uh, Resident Evil Village in a way. Oh God! Oh, what is it? My stomach. It hurts. Something's wrong. Fuck. Oh, yeah, they planted that shit in her stomach. I have to stop. I just... I need... Oh, God. Jesus Christ, Lynn. What's happening here? I thought you were dead. When you fell, I thought we were all dead. It's okay. I'm here. We're gonna get out of here, okay? God. What did they do to you? I, I can't talk about it. Lynn. I have to grave, Please don't ask me. After all these years, They're coming. After They're all coming. Suffering, Bro, broken. poor Lynn, dude. Fucking hell. I don't know. Myself, He's insane. They're all fucking world. insane. The Please, Blake, I just want to get out of here. And she is a friend. What the fuck is going on? I can't. Not now. Let's just get away from this place. Please. Okay. Soak the yeah. earth with their blood! I just the devil from her belly. Was she pregnant prior to, or did I forgot? Stay back! I swear to fucking Christ, the first person who touches me loses their eyes. 
God, no! God, no! God wants the child. God wants the child. Get off me! Get off me! God wants the child. Lynn! No, you... No! No! You motherfuckers! Get off me! You leave her alone! Leave her alone! Bro. Fuck you. Pick up a weapon, something, man. So that guy is it a, is it a, I don't know was it a woman I don't know oh, shit. that character I don't I don't Lynn. I don't remember oh, Lynn. fuck they killed her Jesus. where is she Jesus God oh no they took her that's right fuck were they they called them heretics they called Lynn mother. It's not just a cult. It's, it's two sides. Christians and something else. Fucking hell, bro. Okay, so we're gonna go... See if I can go here to this house on the left. I mean, on the right. I'm sorry. I, I can't even tell proper directions right now. But I can go behind these guys and, and, and knock them out, right? I, I forget if that's even a thing. I don't think I... I don't know. Wait for this guy to turn around and get out of here. Here, go on, go, 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 go. All right, perfect. We've got a dead body here. That is just fabulous. Anything in the first aid box? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Let me charge up the batteries. I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm finding myself using this camera way too often, and I don't like it. It's so like maybe, maybe, maybe I should brighten up the game more. Then I don't want it to be too not scary because then it's just it's defeats the purpose. All right, let's go in here. Oh fuck! 
Okay, another flashback. That is just fabulous. Oh, goodness gracious. What the hell? I'm dreaming. I'm out of my fucking mind. Jessica. I'm sorry I have to do this. You should have loved me. You should have helped me. Jesus, forgive me. I don't know what to do. I'm so, so sorry, Jessica. I remember this. Bro. So I think that's us, Lynn, and then Jessica, right? I don't remember what Jessica has to do with any of this. But I'm here to find out, and I cannot wait. I cannot wait. All right, let me just make sure there's no like batteries or anything lingering around here. Be a battery that I can use. Just never know. Okay, let's go into the school halls. Oh fuck! Oh shit! Responsibility. We can hide in the lockers. Oh my god. Okay. Respect. Ah, fuck. Kindness. Tolerance. Don't play with me, bro. Self is able. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh God. Oh, this is too much, dear, dear Lord. You know, I, I have to be completely fair. Red Barrels, what is it? Is it Red Barrel? Red Barrels? The developers of Outlast, they are really good at making you fucking jump, dude. Like they, they throw these jump scares that you think you're, you're gonna expect them and then you don't, but then you do, but you don't, and you get scared when you think you're not, but you still do. It's, it's like a crazy mixture of like psychological. You know what? Never mind. Scratch that. All right. I, don't know, I feel like it's, it, it, this game feels like it's an indie game, but it's not. It's, it feels like an indie game with the quality of a triple A title. You know how indie games are typically more scary than, you know, triple A horror games. They really are to me, at least. I feel like indie games are super scary. Anybody pooped here? God, bro. The atmosphere in this game is nuts. Oh, God. The women's bathroom. This should be illegal, but hey, we're going to do it anyways. Because there's nobody here. Oh, God. Okay. Hello? My name is Ray, and I, I come in peace. I'm probably supposed to head upstairs, to be honest, but just checking all my options. For <coughs> oh, fucking hell. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? Oh, God. So I know there was another room, like a hallway to go upstairs inside the... Inside of the school, which I wanted to go check out, but it's too late now. Is that the school? Is this where we came from? 
Oh, wow. This is actually where we came from. <laughs> All right. I'm just going to run straight. Oh, nice. Oh, God. Gotta put the glasses back on, okay? <laughs> oh, hi. You're him, ain't you? The outsider. No, so they killed you, didn't they? No. Uh, not yet. But they'll do it if they find you out here. Come on. Who are you? My name's Ethan. But I mean, are you one of them? And which side are you on? Ain't I trying to kill you? I've been unborn. Seen too much to keep the faith. But you're not one of those other ones. The, the, the heretics. Didn't say squat when my wife got skull. Had to get cast out. Didn't complain when not. Pressed himself on my enemy. And she not but 15. I'm sorry. But when he said my grandson, Baby, he put in her was my the Antichrist, and I had to slit her belly and kill the child. Why? Fucking hell, dude. I don't remember any of this. Considering I have a terrible memory, as it is, I can't even remember names in particular video games. So, obviously, to no surprise, I wouldn't remember. I gave her a chance to run. Spun them idiots some stories. I've been gifted with talk my whole life. You probably noticed. Jane Doe. Sorry. Your daughter. She was eight months pregnant. Blonde hair, cut like a boy's. Yeah. What do you know? You seen her? It's why we came here. Is she all right? Please, Mister, just tell me she's okay. She's fine. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. And God bless you. Come on, get you inside. Bro, look at this. <clears throat> oh, oh, hey, hey there. You really busted your head open, didn't you? I'll be okay. I. You head down the roof, cellar. Come back down there. You can hide. Get you fixed up. Yeah, I'm sorry. You're still not normal. There's something off about this guy. I know something happens here. Well, I don't know. I think. I have a feeling. I don't. It's all right. You just relax here. I'll keep you safe. You rest up and heal. Ethan's gonna treat you right. The fuck is Ethan? How do I how do I heal up? Well, that's not what I wanted to do. Sleep. Oh my god. I'm trying to remember how to how to heal myself with a bandage because I have bandages in my pocket, but I keep finding them, so I want to use one to get the new one and you know be full health and still have bandages. But I don't quite remember. Please play. I knew where the outsider was. The prophet don't need your help in finding the devil's whore and her up me. No questions even now, other heretics at chapel. 
God will guide. Uh, ain't I hurt? Oh God. You sin when you denied the prophet, your daughter. You sin since to deny. Let's just let me talk to now. No. The outsider is. His seed begat the enemy. God and the prophet both want to. Just his let me blood. talk to now. I can explain. God don't hear dead men. Be still. Take your penance. God loves you. God loves you. Oh. They tore that boy off. Give me up to her. God, even though she. Thank you. Bro, this game is brutal, dude. Oh my God. <laughs> this game is crazy. That woman, or whatever she is, beat him to death. Something about finding Lynn. Something about a, a chapel. All right, so we're going to end it here, guys. Um, we've been recording for a good minute. So this is going to be about an hour or so of Outlast 2. I don't know if I'll continue it as a series. Um, obviously... I just wanted to revisit it, but if the video really does well and you guys would like to, then we can make it an entire full series here on the channel. All you guys have to do is just drop the video like. Um, but before, let me read this real quick. It says, Paul, you got to tell Papa that Anne Lee was sick, and that's the truth. She's going to live with her mama and the rest of the scald. She was horrible. Uh, she was horrible, afflicted, and her injuries too doleful for examination and just sent her off because it was all I could do. Just, uh, just got to know I wouldn't have uh, done it if there was any other choice because I loved that girl more than my life or anything else. And I don't know why Papa Noth would think I was lying about you. Uh, I was lying, but you got to convince him to the truth. God love you. Your cousin, Ethan. Papa Noth is in charge of it all. Fuck. All right, guys. Uh yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you guys had a good time a lot of things that i did not recall or remembered from the first hour which uh, of this game which was really fascinating just so much detail attention to detail so much complexity of everything that's going on not just graphically but what a fantastic game anyways thank you and uh i will catch you on the next one